Hey guys, so somebody left a message that the tips were burning up very fast on their soldering iron. So I like the Snyder a lot. If you run it too hot or for too long, it'll burn up the tips. And what it does is it burns off the coating that's on the tips. And then once you burn off that coating, solder won't stick to it. And if solder won't stick to it, you can't really solder with it. You need to be able to tin this with solder and you get a lot better heat transfer. So as you can see over time, I've burned up several tips. Uh, this still has a little place that's still got coating, but the rest doesn't. I have a bad habit of leaving this on and walking away. Uh, I need to quit that. Not very safe overall, but it burns up the tips. So, since somebody mentioned that, I thought I would demonstrate how to restore the tips. I went online and bought this solder paste mechanic tip refresher lead free ncn20 made in china uh, i don't know what this stuff is i'll be honest with you let's turn this on and start getting it up to temperature i usually try to do about 550 another reason my tips burn up is i work on these old radios restoring the tube radios and i found that when you're disconnecting wires and this is the connection to the antenna this is a connection to the speaker another antenna connection uh, I had to remove those to get in there to, to work on the chassis. And you have to use an incredibly high temperature. I think I'm running 700 to melt those. Uh, and that burns up your tips faster. Uh, by the way, this is cleaned and nothing else. I still have to deal with a little bit of rust and use some contact cleaner to try to get some of that stuff off of there. Okay, so it went up to temperature, which was actually pretty quickly. So if you have a tip that's bad, you want to dip it in here and have it melt. Okay, that soldering iron is not hot enough because it didn't go down in the paste. So let that come up to temperature again. I'll try 600. You don't want to go too high or it won't stick. So I want to do the original depth of the tip. There you go. See a nice tinned tip that will now work correctly the tips are about a dollar and i paid five dollars for this so if i restore five tips then theoretically it's paid for itself you probably need to restore 10 or 15 tips but only two or three tips come with this and if you burn them up quickly you've got to go buy some more so this would let the tips that came with it last a little bit longer so what you do is get on amazon or aliexpress and search for tip refresher uh, I think it does two things. I think it takes off the oxidization and tries to put a coating back on it. Uh, but you want it to you want it to sink very slowly into that. So I think this would do for a while. And to be honest with you, my tips would last a lot longer if I didn't forget to turn the soldering iron off. So there you go. Uh, how to make your tips last longer with the Snyder soldering iron. If you like the videos, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.